basically welcome once again to my channel once again guys your host mr namshan today i'm back with a new amazing photoshop tutorial guys so in this video basically i'm going to show you how to create the trail lights or the uh, you have seen the lights behind the cars uh, whatever you might say uh, so if you don't know what i'm really talking about so it may be really look something like this what i've also provided the link of the images which i've used in this video in the description so you could used as a reference and you could edit uh, the same thing with me basically if you zoom in uh, within each trail you may see that each trail is consist of uh, four four to five lines and for that what we need is a custom brush uh, to make these trails and don't worry about the color we will automatically change it uh, further in this video but now let's create a simple uh, trail so that you could use anywhere first of all just create a new document uh, and make sure that you've selected the pixels and just create a 500 into 500 pixels uh, new document and once you're there now let's create a new a uh, custom brush so what you now need to do is now just select the hard brush and once you're here just uh, uh, make the size to 80 approx and what we are going to do is we will just uh, plot four dots here on this and now I will tell you why we are doing basically, basically something like this so now just create uh, click on edit then select define brush preset and now let's rename it to four dot so that's it so once you have done with this now here comes the main part so as you could see we are creating those four to five lines uh, in this case we are creating four lines uh, as our light trail so this uh, will be our light trail so this is an image which we are going to use I have created our custom uh, light trails in this video itself so now you could use your own light trails and you could plot it anywhere so now let me just give you a tip instead so if you want to create a straight light trail what you need to do is select any of the point holding shift uh, move up release the cursor uh, where you want this light trail to be and that's it now do with the other parts also so that's it once you have created the basic part of the light trail now let's give the outer shadow also so uh, if you want to go also overlap our the light trails with another color also to give it a good feel so in my case i'm selecting yellow and doing the same step which we have done in the previous once you have done with this now let's go ahead and create uh, the neon effect which we basically say just create a new layer and just uh, go ahead to the outer layer and here what you need to do is just nothing uh, you could adjust the setting here whatever you want just make sure that you have selected normal here and select the neon layer whatever you want so in my case I'm selecting it to yeah purple looks kinda good and now you could just select how much the layer should be so once you've done with this now let's go ahead and now create the layer and now let's use the same step once again to border our uh, light rails so as you could see it will really give our light rails a neon effect now you could also customize how much you want the opacity to be and also if you want you also increase the blurriness of the neon light which we have just created the outer layer and that's it once you're done with this now just go ahead and press ok mostly when we are doing something background also matter must so what you need to do is now go ahead and select the curves and move it to little reddish so just make sure that you select the red and move it from the center just move it to a little far to give it a more red a background around so it may really look cool while editing stuff like this so this is just a tip if you want to also use this but it is not a mandatory to use this or not so it's up to you if you want to also use this up so 
this was how you could really use this so we back to the next line that is the creating the neon lines around a banner something like that so if you want you can also go ahead and create that so for what uh, so what you need to do is just select the pen tool and select the area uh, of what you really want the neon lines to be around so in my case i'm selecting uh, this banner instead and once you're there is just go ahead and do over the brush now let's customize this first now make sure that you have selected uh, reduce the size uh, as the our banner is lines are smaller and make sure that you have selected the preferred color so in my case I am selecting it to green yeah it really looks cool and yeah once you're there once we have customized our uh, brush now what you need to do is just right click and select the stroke path and make sure that you have selected the brush and once you're there just tap so similarly if you want to also do this with many other objects also so something like this one so that's it guys thanks for watching i hope this video is really helpful and if yes please don't forget to subscribe i really don't know if you are able to see this or not uh, and yeah for more photoshop tutorials you could just go ahead and subscribe me and let me know if you are really interested so i, I could make many more videos like this and then bye guys your host mr namster see you in the next video signing out